OK, here's a very quick video tutorial to show you how to use scenes inside of Flash. So I'm starting with a new ActionScript 3 file here. I'm just going to create scene number 1. OK, so automatically we're on scene number 1. So I'm just going to do a very quick bit of animation here, just using a shape tween. So I'll insert um, a blank keyframe here and I'll draw another shape of a different colour, like so. Right click up here and create a shape tween. So there's scene number one, which is blue square, turning it into red circle. Okay, so to insert a new scene, choose insert and then scene, and this will take us to scene number two. Now scene number two is going to be, um, let me see, um, a polygon. So here we are, we've got a red um, pentagon, and we'll shape tween that into a different shape. So let's just choose a rectangle again of a different colour. Okay, I'm going to right click there and choose shape tween. So there's the second scene. So if I test that, control test movie in Flash Professional, it plays scene one followed by scene two. So I'm currently on scene number two. If I want to um, edit scene one again, make some changes to it, I use this little icon here which allows me to navigate between scene 1 and scene 2. OK, so I can go back to scene 1 and I can make some changes here. So, for example, if I wanted to change the colour of this, then I could. And I can also flick back to scene 2 and again make some changes here if I wanted to. Uh, perhaps just change the shape a little bit. So I'll cut some bits out, just using the selection tool, like so and you'll see that that changes the animation and if I decide that the scenes are in the wrong order I can open up uh, this panel here so go to window other panels and then scene and this is the scene panel where you can drag them around into a different order you can also delete scenes here by just pressing this button here um, and you can duplicate a scene. So if you wanted to reuse a scene again, you can press the duplicate button and it will make a, a copy. Okay, I'll just remove that like so. And it's possible also to uh, rename the scenes. So I could give it another name, intro, and double click this and end. Okay, so that's a quick intro on how to use scenes inside of Flash.